Hey, now. So we've made it to the rooftop. Not a bad view. Uh, from here, my old hotel was just behind this building here. building I'm staying in now is that green building right here. That building right there is the $500 a night hotel rooms. I can't believe that. Oh, I'm going to sit down and get comfortable here. Pump that down a little bit right there. All right. And straight off to there, off in the distance, I bet you can see the gold on top of that mountain there, there's Swaibuden. It's uh, about an hour and a half walk from here and I've walked it many, many times, many different ways to get there. I like to circumnavigate that whole mountain. It takes about an extra hour to do that. On the far side are some very interesting uh, things to see over there. I can remember, once again, I, I say that a lot in all my videos. In 1993, when I was here, there was rice fields between these buildings, and none of these buildings were here. This one was, but that one wasn't. But anyway, from this was virtually the edge of town, just off here, maybe 10, 15 blocks. There's actually a river running there, through there, 15 blocks away. And that was the edge of town. And the other side of that, all the way up to the hill, was uh, uh, rice fields. Me and Rob made that walk one time that I can remember back in 93. This tree knoll that's sticking above the buildings there, that is a natural preserve, uh, wildlife preserve. Uh, you don't have to pay to get in there, but it's all gated and there actually is people walking it and there's trails through it. Uh, I've walked over there a couple times. It's really quiet and nice. Uh, no religious shrines on that, on that mountain, which is kind of interesting. And if we could just get some clear sky right through here, we could see the Himalayas. Right about over here, actually, so we'd be blocked from here. From the top of that building, probably has a spectacular view at sunrise. Everest would be right off to that direction, I believe. That's due north north and a little bit of east to Everest. And this is right under the flight path of the bats. Saw the bats last night for the first time. I'm going to try to come up here tonight and see if I can get any video of the bats. I just got a weird feeling like this whole thing was crumbling away. The pit of my stomach just took a woo. You know, once you get that fear, it's hard to shake it once it skirts through your body like that. Off in the distance here, here's three little boys climbing up to the rooftop of the building that they're living in or sitting in. Oh my. The best part, see how quiet it is up here? I like this tree up close. It kind of blocks the view, but there's a few nests in it. And it goes all the way down through the building there. What are we doing here? We're at 3 minutes and 50 seconds. Oh. oh, I can smell something good. I can smell onions being grilled somewhere in the kitchen. Mm. Oh, that's heavenly. That sandwich was good today. I wish I'd taken some pictures. I kind of wish I just shot a video in there just while we were talking. I got to do that more. Just pull out the camera and let it run some. Anyway, I've shot about five or six of these videos today. I'm going to go down to the room here, peel off my sweaty clothes, turn on the fan, put a few crumbles of hashish in the pipe, and uh, play with the videos and Maybe I can get one of these posted up today. Anyway, uh, this is the last one. I'm not going to show a video climbing down. If you never see a video, you know I fell off that ladder. All right, bye.